Hi, I'm Toby Puddock. Join me as I bring you fresh ideas for Christmas. So we'll just give that a little bit of a toss through. Using the freshest seasonal ingredients that are delicious. The lemon's good, huh? Simple. It's gonna tear it straight in. And great value. And today, my old friend Bridget Palmer and I are gonna bring you maple glazed Dutch carrots. I really love the flavour of the syrup in this dish. It brings out the sweetness of the Dutch carrots. I love that by blanching them, then taking them to the pan with the honey and the maple and the thyme brings such an earthiness to this as well. You will need Dutch carrots, select butter, maple syrup, thyme and select walnuts. Click below for the recipe and full list of ingredients. So the first thing we want to do here is give these carrots a quick blanch in boiling salted water. And we're just going to put enough salt so it can just be tasted into this water. So about, you know, a half teaspoon yeah. or around there. And this will start the seasoning process from the word go with these. These Dutch carrots were delivered by Woolies, but if you don't have any in the fridge, I swap them out for regular carrots and just quarter them lengthways. It works just as well. Good tip. And I just want to blanch these just for about a minute because they're going to continue cooking in the pan with all of our flavours after. So they can go straight in. So we're going for about 40 or 50 grams of butter, which I know is about there. And that can go straight in. We're going to go about quarter of a cup of maple syrup. So what will happen is this butter will start to melt down. We can think about getting some thyme into there as well. Yep. And I see you're picking some there picking already. Some it's fresh very good. Time. What do we want about sort of six, eight sprigs of this so we can get them straight into there. And then we can put some over at the end as well. So, Bridget, I'm just pulling the carrots out. And it doesn't matter if we actually take a little bit of the water into the pan. It'll just help loosen all of this up a little bit. You can find that sometimes with the maple in there, it can get quite thick and almost quite yeah. toffee-ish. So now we can start to just gently toss these around. Dutch carrots, or baby carrots, are usually sweeter and smaller than their standard counterparts. They're great in salads, pasta sauces, casseroles, or on their own as a healthy snack. Now, I'm going to bash up these walnuts that I've lightly toasted in the oven. Nice. So as you can see now, a lot of the butter and the maple has started to really melt down. It's being absorbed into the carrots. And what I'm looking for is the outer skin of the carrots to really start to blister from this. But I want the inside of the carrots to be really crunchy and our dente still, which is why it's really important to almost undercook them in the water, because we're twice cooking here. So how are those walnuts looking? They look fabulous. So I'll just pop them straight in. And I think it's really nice to get a different coarse texture. We get a lot of that really fine powdery walnut coating the carrots. Yeah. But we almost get the coarser bits of the walnut actually frying a little bit in that yeah. butter there. And giving it that beautiful crunch. The last thing I want to do here is bring in some extra virgin olive oil to this. And the reason for that is not to cook with it, but for flavour. So we'll just give that a little bit of a toss through. And you can see the shine that brings as well. Yeah. Let's go to the plate like that. Just give them a little bit of a twist around as we go. Yeah. And look at that, Tobes. Maple glazed Dutch carrots with walnuts. And that's it. We did it. Easy, team. Thank you. <laughs> now, if you like that, all ingredients can be purchased at your local Woolies and online by clicking here. To subscribe to our YouTube channel, click here. To explore all our other fresh idea recipes, click here. And for more side dish recipes, click here.